Hello my YouTube fans. So I am here with a new video and this is the third part of the Pijo Crystal Lighter video. So in this video I will be showing you how to measure the potential difference of the Pijo Crystal Lighter. And you might be thinking why I am doing this because in my second video I said this. So with this amount of force 800 volts are generated which is sufficient to create an electric arc due to the huge potential difference between the two terminals. And then I got this comment. Thank you so much Felix for pointing this out. So actually it is not 800 volt definitely it is 2000 or more than that. So here what I did after uh, I have seen your comment I started measuring it again with the same multimeter so previously I have measured it with this melt multimeter only but there was some uh, problem in the connection due to which I was getting very less value and also this multimeter ideally can read 750 volt only so this time I have attached the probes with jumper cable and another end of the jumper cable is attached with the lighter terminals. Terminals are the points in between which the arc is getting generated. So as this connection is proper and intact, when I started measuring the potential difference, something happened to my multimeter due to the high voltage uh, generation and something blown inside the multimeter due to which my multimeter started malfunctioning so we will see that in the video uh, so you can see uh, I am triggering it from the lighter you can see the potential difference is generating but my multimeter is unable to read that difference and uh, till now everything it looks good but one jumper cable got detached I'm trying to hook it up with the spring and here we go mm, there is some issue in the connection and here we go yeah now it's not working properly So let me adjust it a bit okay so let's uh, remove this part and I will do it directly from the piezo uh, I mean what you say this trigger and piezo setup uh, I will do it from here so now you can see I will trigger it again okay here we go you have seen the 500 volt reflected on the screen but that was not proper before that you might have seen the infinite minus one or something like that so the voltage is definitely higher than the uh, multimeter range and still my multimeter is working uh, properly it is not malfunctioning as of now you can see uh, it came like 700 or more than that and now my multimeter is gone you can see the garbage value 260 volt or 257 volt is showing so uh, right now I'm not triggering anything something happened with the multimeter I'm just checking that part so Definitely it is generating a lot of voltage, not a lot of potential difference due to which uh, general multimeter blown away. Some IC or some chip uh, got damaged internally. So uh, later I have searched this on the web and came to know that the voltage divider circuit is the only method uh, via which you can measure the higher potential difference with a multimeter so no multimeter will support the voltage range of 6000 volt or more than that uh, for that you need to use voltage voltage divider circuit and with that you need to connect the probe and uh, then you can measure the voltage so guys later i tried uh, to do quick fix on my multimeter ad as well taking off the back cover taking out the battery doing a normal power drain or reset kind of thing it's not actually resetting the things but uh, maybe the power supply 
uh, if we are draining so sometimes the electronic devices is working back again so here we go and it's not working so the the device is completely gone and something blown up inside and due to which it is it is not working or maybe the calibration ic is burnt up that's why it is uh, giving the false value in all the uh, what you see selection what i am doing on the multimeter it is giving the false value and this is just the beep thing i think it will work so that's it guys uh, i think this is a good lesson for me and thanks felix for your valuable comment and noticing that out uh, so hope uh, you guys have also learned a uh, few things from this video if so please do like this video share this video and subscribe my channel for the latest update stay tuned stay healthy see you in the next video bye bye